The name of this interesting fish comes from the French tanche, which in turn was derived from the Latin tinker. There can be no mistake in identifying tench, the rounded shape of the fins and powerful, almost straight tail are characteristic. The tiny scales and small orange rimmed eyes, together with the general coloration of tench, are so distinctive that once having seen these fish, the novice cannot be misled. You know what guys? I do fancy a bit of tench fishing on the stick float and centre pin. scrap that was. A nice looking frisky little fellow here. Pretty nice condition apart from a bit of a tatty dorsal. Um, yeah very nice. Four pounds six ounces. Really lovely condition. Uh, like all the fish very dark green due to the weedy and deep nature of this lake. Um, the spot I'm fishing actually shows you what they're feeding on to. There's a there's water snails um, just on the side of one of his fins there. A couple of water snails, so shows you what they're rooting about in and um, sifting through. Just on a couple of maggots, single red maggot and a white maggot, run up the shank of the hook to cover it on a size 14. Great fun on the centre pin though. As I say, like all the fish in here, really nice and dark. Lovely paintbrush pattern to it as well. You can see where they generate all their power. They're such lovely looking creatures, aren't they? Really lovely. Orange teddy bear eyes. Anyway, let's get this lovely looking tinker slipped back so it can fight another day like a right stinker. I could get used to this lovely five pound ten ounce mouth tench. Lovely dark fish, cracking scrap on the pin. Wonderful. 
It's just on lobworm, tip of a single white maggot. Yeah, it's a, it's a lovely looking fish. Really good scrap, I tell you. Short, um, kind of scrap, but bloody powerful. Had me going, I tell you. Lovely looking fish. An absolute lovely, dark looking male tinker. Beautiful. Absolutely lovely. Breaker, but a personal best breaker nonetheless. Absolutely thrilled, <laughs> really made up. Nice evening time fish on the pin. I was just going down to my maggot box after casting. As I looked down, I just saw the wobble. I was like, oh, crikey, give me a chance. Oh, it's a reasonably good scrap, I tell you. <laughs> it's a beauty, though, isn't it? Look at that. What a well built female. I think most of these fish are spawners, so this one would go a lot bigger. A nice breeze book female though. <laughs> lovely, lovely colour to it. Just pull myself back. There you go. <sighs> yeah, very nice. Very, 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 <laughs> very nice. Certainly very thick set fish. It's an absolute pearl. Yes! Well, it's come to that point in the video where it's more or less the end of this particular vlog entry and I hope you've enjoyed this particular one fishing for tench on centre pin and stick float and I'd just like to say a big thank you to all the people who take time to watch my videos and take the time to engage with me you know it means a lot because despite myself having a really high passion level for our pastime and hobby you know it wouldn't be the same without uh, interaction with you chaps you know engaging with me via YouTube comments via Facebook so that really does mean a lot if you have liked the video do click that like button it helps to share the video and gives it more coverage as well and if you're not subscribed hit the subscribe button that way you'll be kept up to date with all my latest trips and latest video entries showing areas that I'm fishing and what I'm targeting now for anyone that hasn't liked the video all I can say is that you really haven't got a soul. Uh, um, not that kind of soul, um, but that is a, a soul anyway. <laughs> um, yes, I think that might have been from the last tench angler on this particular venue where he lost his soul to the tench. Anyway, I'll see you on my next video. Tight lines and until next time, take care. But remember, if it's not broke, you don't have to fix it. But sometimes it never hurts to tinker, tinker. <laughs> Take care, guys.